Welcome back, you guys. This is the Syndrome. Deciding what to play as my next campaign, I did get uh, Muscovy suggested as a uh, potential thing. I don't know what the objective would be then. Like, uh, we could always just do what they all do and just expand all of these colonies to the east here with that new third row mechanic. I haven't tried it. I don't think I've played as Muscovy either. We started with a fuckload of development. Uh, 22 provinces. So it's less than uh, 10 development on average, but that's still pretty good. Uh, okay. Oh wow, these are some pretty shit. Oh, never mind. This is pretty good. Yeah, so it's basically this one. And, ooh, Land Force Limit Modifier, 33%. Damn! Shock damage plus 10. Alright. We start out with 5 vassals, but I'm guessing it's these nobodies. Alright. Alright, let's see what happens. Uh, these first videos are always so slow, because you always have to, you know, see what you're doing who your allies are, how you want to expand, everything like that. All right. Uh-huh. So, these are my vassals. Oh, you're not, I'm not connected to this one. Okay, so I've got uh, this one. There is not my uh, vassal. So I could just eat him, I suppose. Mm hmm. Yaroslav. I got a core in Novgorod. Mm hmm. I got too many calf, as I always do. Let's see. Trade notes. Oh, this is a shit trade note. It flows in from here, and there's nothing here. I have to colonize this node. I don't like this. I want to move. Uh, wait, is that mine? Yeah, this is mine. Moscow. I want to move here. Uh, I don't know about this node. It's Lithuania and Poland. That's going to be a problem. If uh, Poland does not get the union over Lithuania, maybe. Maybe. But I am liking this node over here, though. I have a merchant here. What is he doing? I'm collecting here? That's just weird. Alright, let's uh... I'm transferring this trade power to here. What the fuck? Isn't this my main node? No, this is my main node. Okay. Why am I collecting here then? This is weird. But the white sea guy is gonna move. Alright. I have what? I have four states. Ah, Cossacks. So. Hmm. It's just cavalry. Lose one five prestige, okay. Race Cossack host. Okay. Ooh, I get uh army advisors. Army uh that, that's more of an army institute. I like that. Gain ten army tradition, that's kinda limited. So this is interesting. It's not immediately useful, but, um, you know. Uh -huh. This is 25 combined. Uh -huh. Burgers don't have, they have fuck all, but I do have... Oh, is this my capital? No. What is my capital? 
So Moscow is my main capital. I can't give this to the burgers, but I can give both of these to the burgers. No, never mind. This is not my mine. I can give this to you. Mm -hmm. Alright, alright. I need five more influence burgers. Uh, doesn't matter which one it is, to be honest. I can just revoke it later. Give me a minister, and it seems I can't get 70, uh, 150 from them, but that's fine. Okay. Mission. Improve relations with their... I kind of want to conquer them. Okay. Conquer Novgorod. So, this is going to be a rival of mine, I assume. Let's see. Denmark, uh, Lithuania, Kazan, and Novgorod. So, Denmark is too far out of the way. I don't want to fuck with Lithuania right now. So, let's at least take Kazan then. And Novgorod. What else do I have here? Denmark and the Great Horde. I pr preferably go after the Great Horde. But, you know, they border me. Uh, reclaim Mulsk. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So yeah, I have a bunch of... Yes. Am I royally married to them? No, I'm not. Well, let's get sorted, shall we? Royally married should drop their liberty desire by a bit. And there we go. Royal marriage. Aha. Uh -huh. Royal marriage. And oh, the republic. Okay. That should drop their liberty desire by quite a bit. Uh, also, states. Oh, what a mess. So, I have one state that belongs to me. And nope. This is a mess. So, I have three states so far that are completely mine. Four. So I got four states that belong to me. It's awesome. Why do I have two forts right next to each other? This is my capital. So this one has to go. And this one. This one is food. Uh, I'll keep this one. Mm. Yeah. So. I could reclaim Vansk. Novgorod, how strong are they? I got 12,000 troops. I have way more than that. Oh god, you're awful. I thought I was a really good one. So... Let's go to war. It's just to reclaim Belsk? No, 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 I'm taking a lot more than that. Also, they are my rivals, so I'm gonna humiliate them so I can get the splendor. I gotta wait until 11th of December to attack, though. So, Tavir, they will not accept vassalization. I have some of their cores. Yeah, so they won't. Uh, I guess I'll just build some spy network against them. I'm gonna eat them up. Who are you? You're nobody. I'm gonna declare war on you later. This is not. This is your capital. And let's actually just look at this. I have territory right here. Oh, this is such a mess. Okay. Uh, what can I afford? I'm expecting to admin right now. 
I got a 312. I think I'll just take this off. This is more balanced. So, discipline. F yeah, give me this guy. What do I have here? Improve relations. Maybe after the war. Yeah. Alright, that's enough. Let's go. Okay. Declare war. You guys go and take the my core back. They only have this army right here, so if I can stack wipe that, we're good. Okay, he's fleeing somewhere up 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 here. They are fleeing. Yeah. I kind of want to wipe out his army before I start uh, sieging. So let's do that. Let's try to catch his army. I'm getting attrition here. Seriously? No, 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 wait. Um, let's just merge my troops up here. He's building more troops, but... Uh, I'm gonna wipe you guys out. Bye bye. Uh huh. Go here and go here. I'm gonna catch him. I'm gonna catch him. He is gonna move to here. I do have the better general, but um, we'll see what happens. I have another army coming. Huh? Let's see. I'm getting a terrain penalty. I do have more discipline, thanks to my dude there. And I have a better general. And he was not stack wiped, right? that's not surprising though. I don't think I need this army to stack wipe the rest of this. Okay, England and France are at war. I'm gonna turn on this best guess thing. And after this war, I'm gonna try to get some alliances. Cargo ball. Is he gonna flee up here? Oh, he's got an army. He's got a dude. Also, the music is very Russian and uh, pretty cool, to be honest. No, 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 I don't want to catch them. Oh, this guy, yeah, I'll kill this guy. Maybe he comes to oh. Yeah. Alright, if he tries to move anywhere, he uh, dies. I'm just gonna take some time to siege stuff. Never mind, he's gonna get a, his morale back. Let's go. Okay, you come down here. You guys, yeah, you're coming down there. Uh, okay, so Poland and Lithuania are now in a personal union. Which means Lithuania is a no-go. I'm gonna need some protection from that then. He's gonna flee all the way down there. Mm -hmm. I'll let this guy finish this. I'll tell him to... Wait, where's he going? He's going down. Mm -hmm. Uh, ooh, he's gonna walk into my army here. That's nice of him. And die. There we go. Where's he going? He's going to... The ship? Oh, he's going down here. Oh, this fort in Novgorod is blocking me. Go there, and you guys finish seizing this. 
He seems this is the only thing he has left now. Oh, he's leaving the siege. That's not good. That was my vassal. Oops. Oh, he's going after my vassal. Bastard. Uh, you guys just handle that siege for now. I think I can handle this with him alone. I'll be relieving this siege right now. So that should be a defensive bonus for me. What? Oh, god damn it. That is not good. I gotta flee. 18th of January. Yeah, we're gonna flee to here. That was unfortunate. I got this. I thought this was a fort. No, it's just a normal province. Alright. But all his army is now down here. I'm not worried. I don't have enough men though. But I'm not worried. Mm, I'm not gonna steal stuff from the bur uh, from the nobles. My heir dies. It's a three, four, five. That's not nice. Get a church in Kaluga. Um, that's a shit church. Okay, give me a five, five, three. I don't care about strength of the claim. If I wanted to go here, he can just be like for that. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna leave. But how strong is this general? This one has siege. All right. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna have it like this. I'm gonna chase down that army. Oh, this is a fort as well. What? What the fuck? Oh, never mind. Yeah, 10,000 men. It's a capital and a fort. Oh, they're attacking my vassal now? Oh, shit. Great Horde insulted us. I'm gonna take his capital to end this bullshit. Yeah. Oh wait, dude, this army is really bad. It's got too many calf. Alright, so I'm not gonna fight with this. This army is ridiculously calf heavy. Let's focus on taking his uh, capital. This thing needs more men. This does also weaken my vassals so they don't get as uppity. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 they're taking some stuff back. I don't mind. They're mostly beat. How is their uh, manpower? Oh, well, they got 11 mercenaries, so they're going into debt. Twenty-eight percent. So once I take this capital, I'm just gonna merge up my troops and go chase the stack. Let my vassals handle this. I would like to link up this territory, but do my vassals have some reconquest? That's also something I wanna know. No, they don't seem to. They have some cores on Kassan though. Okay. Its capital is down. Merge up and go crush. Mm -hmm. Where is he gonna go? 
Livonian order declared war on Novgorod. Yeah, that's a bit late, my friend. I pretty much have everything of theirs. So I gotta make sure that in the peace deal I take stuff that borders the Livonian order. Uh, I don't want the crossing penalty. Okay, there's not gonna be a fight there. They want the peace out. Come on, there we go. Alright, these are all mercenaries. There's nowhere, nowhere to run, so they're just going to go to the next province over, or they're going to get stuck with it. Alright. Go to Moscow, you can stay there. I'm going to let my vassals finish this. Oh no, you're actually telling me they got a province? Motherfuckers. So the Livonian order got a province. Alright, whatever. So, return core. What the fuck? I can't tell you to give me back my core? Alright, so I want this. Oh wait, what do I need for form Russian nation? Owns core province Moscow. Yeah, owns pro core province Novgorod. That's this one right here. Okay. Owns core province Tivir or Yaroslav. Yaroslav. That's my pass. Oh, okay. Okay, that's weird. Owns Ryazan. Ryazan. Oh, that's not my vassal, that's my neighbor. Or Smolensk. Oh, that's not gonna happen. So I'm gonna have to take them form the Russian nation. So I need that. I want Novgorod and this entire uh, state of Novgorod. I want this as well. Um, and I think that's it. I mean... Uh, maybe I want this estuary as well. Let's see, this cost me a hundred p. Uh, it's gonna cost me a hundred war score. Ah, this is a pretty good war. First war. Yeah, let's do it. Ooh. So. Who is unhappy with me? Skov. Why are you unhappy with me? Aggressive expansion? Dude. Fuck off. You're my vassal. Sub reduce overextension, I'll do that. 106. Alright, let's core everything. And we are a great power. Novgorod is no longer a valid rival. I didn't uh, humiliate him. God damn it. I forgot. So who can I make now as a rival? Poland or Denmark? Pass. Let's just rest my troops here in Novgorod. Because I imagine I'm going to get some uh, flak from that. Alright, so you are Tivir. I'm going to... I su completely circled him, so I could just farm some uh, CBs on him and get this for free. Peskov. Just... I'm going to placate you. They are the uh, Republic. Great Horde declared war on Circassia. That's fine. I want Ryazan, so... Don't care. Also, I have too many fortune. This is woods. This is also woods. 
this borders the uh, Lithuanians. Uh, I'm gonna turn off the forts. At least the, uh, not the, not these two. I'm gonna be rebellious. And right now I'm rooting a corruption, so it's gonna be expensive no matter what. And I am out of manpower as well. Kasam, Kasimo. I have rebels over here. Oh, these are Sunni. Families left behind. Yeah, just national manpower is fine. I didn't check my religion. Ah, this is Sunni. Also, yeah, I'm the or I'm uh, Orthodox, so. Religious ideas would be a pretty good thing to do, I imagine. Yeah, I don't have enough. I remember watching the, I think it's like the Dev Diaries or something about doing something to the state. So, what happens if I click this? You can contract the metropolitan in states with third development. If all provinces are orthodox and of accepted culture. So it, it's more expensive to maintain. And most of the devastation is... Yeah, so it's... This is also my capital state, so it's not going to cost me shit. And how much do I need for this? Oh, I can do it right now. Aggressive expansion impact, not I'm worried about that. Manpower recovery speed. Thank you very much. Merchants harassed. Diplomatic insult against Tavir. Yeah, fuck them. I'm trying to, you know, get the CBs on. Uh huh. We're almost done pouring. Now they have peasant problems and everything. I imagine the Livonian order is only gonna take this. Subjugate Kazan, the rival of our rival. Kazan was this dude here. Alright, let's think about alliances, shall we? Your rivals are Livonian order and the two tanks. The two tanks don't like me. Okay. The Great Horde, Crimea, Nogai, Nogai, should we ally Nogai? Yes, I think we will. So we have, oh, we have too many diplomatic relations? Oh, that's right, I have too many vassals. Huh. Sorry, guy. I have to get rid of some of my vassals before I can do this. So I'm blocked right now with allies. Uh, I want to integrate Pascal right away because they are the annoying assholes with uh... They are the annoying assholes that have <sighs> Republic tradition, so I can't really marry them Which means their liberty desire is gonna be higher than if it was otherwise Also, I can't make this into a state Cannot make this into a state because I'm out of states. <sighs> Seriously, I want to just abandon some of these states. Like this one? This is a state. No, I don't. What? It belongs to an estate. Ah, oh, goddammit, I need more state slots. I need a lot more state slots. I can't even... This is a really good province. When do I get more states? Eight. I can't wait that long. I cannot wait that long. I have to revoke something. This one up here... This is not a state. I want to see what my states are right now. 
Okay, so Galich is Moscow is Suzdal. Let's just check the bottom one. Tavir is it's a state. Really? This belongs to an estate. It belongs to the clergy. I'm sorry, clergy. But this state is god awful. I have one out of four. Okay. Now I can state this. That is so much better. Oh, thank god. Clergy are not happy. I can give them. Uh, wait. This goes to the burgers. And I'm taking this from the burgers. The clergy can have this. Yeah. Alright. Well, I'm gonna end it here, you guys. It's been an eventful episode. We just kicked the shit out of uh, Novgorod, which pretty much happens every single game of every EU. Every EU4 game, Novgorod gets their shit kind of kicked out of them. I have to think about integrating some of these vassals because I need diplomatic relationship slots. And that won't happen for five more years. So yeah, I'm gonna have to kick this rebellion in the butt. And maybe I can hire unrest dude? No? No unrest dude? I thought I did. Maybe he died. He probably died. Improve relations, sure. Let's drop some aggressive expansion. So yeah, I'm gonna stop here, you guys. I will see you in the next episode, but until then, see ya.